Four and a half thousand supporters made the trip from Kent for the clash with Fulham that could take the side into Division 2. That's more than Fulham's average home attendance this year. If they come to see a sequel to the horror show at Priestfield earlier in the season when ten players were booked and two from Fulham sent off, they were mistaken. All smiles before the kickoff and not a single booking afterwards. Gillingham had the best chances in a scrappy match. Good work from Leo Fortune West gave Dennis Bailey a chance, but he shot wide. Then Fortune West's effort was palmed round the post. The most miserly defence in the country, Big Jim Stannard returning to the club where he spent 13 years, was barely troubled. Second half, a free kick from Dave Martin and the shot from Glenn Thomas flew just over the bar. But Gillingham can now forget the missed opportunities and concentrate on their first promotion in 22 years. But no celebrations until Meridian breaks the news. Just heard the final score, Exeter and Bury have drawn, so you've been promoted. How do you feel? Hey! How do you feel? <laughs> mate, congratulations. How do you, How do you feel? Ecstatic, <laughs> lovely. Yeah, really good. You've been promoted, well done. Thank you very much. Right, is it for sure? Hey, chairman! I can't put it into words, it's just like a dream, really, to be quite honest. Right. Another clean sheet, it's been a perfect season for you. Yeah, 28 now. Let's see if anyone can beat that one now. So, anyway, let's look forward to Division 2 now. Yeah! But from the manager who's transformed a team on the verge of extinction, a typically more subdued reaction. We're disappointed we never won the game, to be honest, but uh, we didn't realise the result had gone for us until we got in a dressing room and you had the big tier. It's been a smashing um, season. The supporters have been absolutely magnificent. And we're pleased that uh, we're promoted. Dressing room delirium, even if the bubbly refuses to budge. But the champagne feeling is flowing finally for the supporters. Preston's victory means Gillingham can't go up as champions, but that won't spoil the promotion party. So will the chairman win his big money bet and play in the final game? Who's selected? <laughs> I don't know. It's, um, I'll have to look at it tomorrow. I can't, it doesn't all sink in at the moment. It's, uh, it's been a magnificent day, really. And, uh, you can see my suit's been destroyed and lads are giving me some kit to wear. I worry about next week in a week. It'll take a few days to sink in, you know, and it's a credit really to the people that have worked so hard that we managed to achieve such a tremendous thing in the first season. Well, Fulham as a day is a day that will uh, be etched in my heart forever.